staying hydrated. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Welcome back. My name is Emily. And today, today is the day that we prove once again that I'm apparently not a real pilot. Please subscribe to the channel and let's see if I can make it onto the runway for these Microsoft Flight Sim landing challenges. Also, major announcement, we now have Discord. It is all set up. We've been having a really good time, lots of laughs. People have been streaming their flight sim sessions down there. So go ahead, description box, take a look, come and join us. Okay, let's see if I don't crash. Okay, let's go check out these activities and take a look how bad I do. These look so challenging, holy crap. Okay, let's start Let's start with some a bit more basic and then we're gonna build ourselves up. Let's go into Ecuador. That seems like a good time. All right, so we are, we are gonna be flying the Beechcraft King Air. Looks like we're gonna be airborne about 9,200 feet and we're gonna be landing in Quito. The runway there is runway 18. So let's go take a look and see if I can do this. I'm so ready. Okay, disclaimer, I obviously don't know anything to do with these planes. We're just gonna do our best and try to land, okay? Okay, I'm climbing, that's no good. I find that this view on planes that I'm not used to is kind of helping me. I say that now, but it's probably not the case. <laughs> okay, here we go. Feel like I'm high. Ah! Oh, oh no, I'm bouncing! <laughs> we know that's not gonna be good points. We know that, we know that. Okay, 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 it was the first time, first time, right? Okay, what else do we wanna do? France? Toronto? Should I try Toronto? Okay, so this one, we are in the TVM 930, going into Toronto. I've landed at this airport numerous times, but I feel like that is gonna be making about zero difference for these challenges. Arrival runway is runway 26. The runway is just over 4,000 feet and we're just at sea level. Obviously we're just over Lake Ontario and we're gonna be coming in, landing in here. The view of actually going into Toronto City Center, you guys saw in my, some of my first, uh, one of my first videos, it's beautiful. Let's do it. Okay, here we go. That is way too slow. Okay, so we got a steady vertical speed down. The city looks beautiful. I can't really see where the runway is yet. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, I think I see it now. Ooh, that's tricky with the sun. <sighs> Anybody else get nervous for this? Just me? Okay. The approach looks a bit better, I think. Little high. <sighs> I have to not, I have to remember to not pitch so much coming in. I overdo it. Maybe my sensitivity is too high excuses. Oh, I still got to bounce. Well, we got more points than last time though. So improvements. I don't know how you guys do it. I'm so bad at flying in this. I feel like I could teach, but I don't know about the actual landing part. These are the basic ones too. Holy crap. Okay. I haven't gone to Chile. I just added this one here. Should I try it? I haven't actually tried the Suwa no Se, Suwa no Sejima in Japan. Please correct me on how to say that. Ooh, we're on a, like a, a little elevated patch on an island. 
We are going to be 1,600 feet going down to 350 feet above sea level. Runway length is just over, or just shy of 2,700 feet, short runway. And a landing runway 32 in the 172. Oh, I got to do a circuit pattern. Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. I'm trying to be inside for a little bit, see, see what I feel, but just feel like my view is so thrown off. <laughs> Cloudy, moody. I like it. I can't even see where I'm going. Oh, there's a rainbow. Okay, so three, two, right? We said. Start my right downwind. Okay. And then. This is not going to give me enough space. Ah, more flaps. Oh my God. I overdid it for sure. <laughs> I'm going to spin it. Oh, are we going to be able to recover? Will she do it? <laughs> okay. It's a bit more swirly in this one. Not going to lie. Oh my goodness. If I recover this, you guys, you guys, you guys. If I land on the runway, I don't, I just need to land on the runway. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. That is how you don't do a circuit. <sighs> oh, potato queen. Terrible, terrible. That one is fun though. I like doing the little circuit. <sighs> okay, what else? Let's go again to Japan. We'll do another one there. Okay, so we are in an Airbus 320 Neo. Brand spanking new. We are going into Hashijojima. Did I say that right? Wow, that looks so pretty. All right, we are landing runway 08. Runway length is just over 6,500 feet. We're just above sea level. Oh, we gotta go around this. No problem. It's no problem. Oh, I'm twisting it too much. I can't wait to fly something like this in real life though, right? Okay, I've never done these by the way, so. Okay, I can kind of see the runway there, I think. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. Put your seat belts on. Frick, how do you guys do this without rudder pedals? I find that yaw is really hard to control. Too high, Emily. This is not gonna be nice. Look at that angle of attack, it's way too high. Okay, okay, let's correct. Ah! Oh my God, is that something on the runway? What is that? Oh, never mind. Ah, ah. <laughs> oh my goodness. I think that's called a nose gear landing. How do you guys do this? <laughs> hey, at least I made it on the runway, right? Is that the goal? I think that's cool. <laughs> Or am I winning based on the lowest score possible? Because I feel like that's what's currently happening. Okay, what else we got? I feel like I can't go harder than this. Okay, screw it, let's just do it. I did terrible in every single one of these. This is so embarrassing. Okay. I don't even gonna try the strong wind. Okay, comment below if you want to see me attempt, even attempt the strong winds one because I, I can't even. Do we try to finish Masaba? Do we do it? Okay, screw it, let's do it. <laughs> Okay, let's try this one more time. If you guys haven't watched the video of me nailing it the first time, go ahead and do so. <laughs> We're in the, bay, the King Air once again. Runway is 30. The runway is less than a thousand feet, which is insane. And it's on this precipice of death. Both ends. Do you guys ask for this? I don't know why. I 
I've been here and I would never want to come here with a King Air. Like that is, mm -mm, mm -mm. I really don't know if this view is helping me or not. I really don't know. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I don't know why I do this for you guys. I'm so high now. Oh. <laughs> I'm airborne again. <laughs> no. <laughs> is that better or is that worse than the first time? I don't know. Comment below. Okay, we're gonna try the Cessna 172 going to Lanata Grande in, where were we again? Chile. Runway three through three, th 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 three, two, runway like 3,600 feet. And we're just over 10,000, correction, 1,000 feet. Not too high up. Let the plane lower itself onto the runway, which I've done zero times at this point. Maybe this is better if I'm in, inside the flag. Like I don't know. It's so hard. I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys do? I don't know. I suck at this. Side note, I did download prepared and I'm looking to do the Q400 add-on. If you're stoked for that, for me doing a tutorial, startup in the flight deck, cold to dark, no, dark to startup in the Q400, comment a potato emoji below. Does, did I not get a bounce on this one? Oh my lord. What does that X mean? I don't even know. I got some points on this one. That is it for today. Thank you so much for watching everybody. Let me know if you guys would wanna see round two of basically Emily fails landing challenges. That should probably be the name of this video. But let me know if you guys want to see that once again, or let me know also in the comments if you guys are wanting me to kind of reel it back in, do some more basic tutorials with the Microsoft Flight Sim 2020. So let me know what you guys think. Please subscribe to the channel if I made you laugh. If you laugh, you have to subscribe. That's just the rule. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.